What piece of career advice would you give to the current generation of young professionals who are looking to become future foreign policy leaders? Uh, I would say a couple of things. First, uh, don't give up. It's worth it. Uh, I think foreign policy now is much more interesting than it was for my father or, uh, or my mother. Uh, in that, it, it's become much more diverse, much more fluid. Uh, during the Cold War, which many of you won't remember, foreign policy was basically like sumo wrestling. You know, it was two big guys trying to push each other out of the, out of the little circle. Uh, now it's a bit more like fencing, but fencing with five people at the same time. Uh, it's lighter, it's more quick. Uh, you have to be looking in every direction at the same time. But we are now able to engage, and unfortunately sometimes have to engage, uh, in areas of the world which didn't get the attention that they used to. So it's very, very interesting. It is a very interesting time to be uh, in foreign policy. The second thing I would say is uh, make sure you do lots of different things when you're young. Don't just specialize, if you can avoid it, too early and try many things, all in the broad field of foreign policy, but try development try defense, try pure diplomacy. By the time you get to be a little bit older, the fact that you've had that experience uh, will open up many more jobs for you, will op open up many more opportunities for you. So I would take the opportunity when you're young, by the way, this is something I didn't do and should have done, to move around, uh, try different things, find the thing that you like, and, and get yourself a broad uh, CV, uh, a broad resume, which I think will stand you in good stead uh, when you get a little bit older. Final thing I would say is um, whether or not we like it, internships, taking short-term positions in various, different, uh, in various different ministries or departments or international organizations has clearly paid off for a lot of people who now work for me or who have worked for me in the past. So I would say, you know, go out there, try it, go to different parts of the world. Uh, and experiment while you're young it gets harder when you're older uh, and it really pays off.